Soul Survivors of Chicago presents close your eyes that's all you see is just your brother hanging from a garage and it's kind of just something you really don't want to think about but it's a constant nagging thought you know in the back of your head every second of the day even though you know you could have a smile on your face you know but it's still there to actually know that uh this occurred and to have those those visions i uh could not blink without seeing my son hanging from a noose or something like a tree. And the visual of it is very real. I think me and my child, my daughter, will experience that for the rest of our lives. There's no way to describe how I'm feeling. And I would never want no one to be in my shoes dealing with what I'm dealing with. Pain, I'm angry, I'm bitter, frustrated. I'm just angry. I really am. Because someone robbed me of my joy. And how do you deal with that? And on May 27th, 2020, I lost my son to suicide. His name was Jamal. He was 19 years old. And it was the worst day of my life. Thank you.